Hello and welcome. Today we're going to speak about the 54B circumvallate papillae. The first one, we can't see it on the slide too much outside the microscope, but don't worry, we're going to see it well. So that was the two pictures of the circumvallate papillae. Here we have a good look of the circumvallate papillae. Within, within it we have the connective tissue. It looks really good, at least maybe like a strawberry, I think. And um, sometimes you can also get a broad or flattened circumvallate papillae. And it looks like this. Here we have the circumvallate papillae that is more broad. You can't see the uh, strawberry form that much, but you can see the connective tissue inside and the secondary circumvallate papillae. So this is the primary circumvallate papillae. I'm going to speak about the secondary circumvallate papillae soon. Just wait. So all of that structure is called circumvallate papillae. All of it. The full strawberry is called circumvallate papillae. So here we have the primary circumvallate papillae for the thousandth time. And now we're going to have the secondary papillae for invagination. So what exactly is the secondary papillae? Well, it's just the invagination. It's not the whole strawberry. It's just the invagination, as, as you can see here. Uh, the connective tissue that invaginates on the wall. And then uh, on the side of the circumvallate papillae, we have the taste buds. So think of the, the circumvallate papillae as a, as a strawberry. And on the strawberry, we always have uh, the seeds. You know, the yellow seeds. Think of those as uh, the taste buds. So the taste buds are always lateral. They are on, on the wall between the trench. What? What is the trench? I'm going to show you that right now. Here we have the trench. So what was the trench? It's the space between the circumvallate papillae and the other part. So this is the trench. It's between the two of them. And this circumvallate papillae, it's flattened or broad as we can call it. It doesn't look much as a strawberry but we know what it is so once again the trench is the space between two papillae going on we have the serous gland right here so as you can see the uh, my arrow all of that on top of it is the serous gland so that is the serous gland we also have a serous duct as I can show you here this is the duct of the serous gland it's open it is open to the trench so the duct of the serous gland opens to the trench and the trench was the space between the two papillae circumvallate papillae with this said i'd like to thank you and please come again